Yo, 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 what's good, Goodies420 family? Bass drop keys, your friendly neighborhood, Negro. And guys, I want to welcome you back to the Goodies420 channel. In today's video, we're going to be talking about a couple things. First, we're going to talk about how much, if any, Everclear do you lose whenever you're making your green dragon inside of your magical butter machine? I recently on one of my videos had this question posed to me and since that's not something that I've covered here on the channel I thought that that would make a good video to do right now So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be making some green dragon or a tincture with the magical butter machine and we're actually going to see how much if any do we lose whenever we make it. Just recently on the channel, I made tincture using the Levo. Whenever I did that, firstly, we didn't even know if we could do it. It did work out. But secondly, whenever we did make it, we had a 25% loss. I put one cup in the machine and whenever we got finished, it ended up being three quarters of a cup. So that was a 25% loss that we got whenever we did it with the Levo. So today what we're gonna do is we're gonna see what loss do we have, if any, whenever we use our magical butter machine. And also guys, let me say this real quick. My great grandparents raised me and one of the things that they taught me was you always need to have the right tool for the right job. I was having a discussion with one of the patrons that's on my Patreon and she was talking about using the French press hack with the Levo and using more cannabis in order to make a tincture. That also goes with what we're doing today. You need to have the right tool for the right job. The Levo is really a machine that's more for smaller to mid batches because you're only going to be doing half a cup to two, two and a half cups at most in the Levo. With the magical butter machine or the electric infuser, you can do two to five cups in these machines. So that's what I was talking about, about having the right tool for the job. Depending on what you need it for, if you're somebody that's going to be doing all smaller batches, then that might be something that's going to be more applicable to what you're doing. Whereas if you're going to be doing bigger batches or mid-side batches, the Magical Butter Machine or the Electric Infuser is a machine that would be better for you. At any rate, no matter what you decide to get, no matter if it's the Magical Butter Machine or the Electric Infuser, you can find both of the products on my website, shop.goodeats420. Com. Right now, the Magical Butter Machine is on sale for $175. The Decart Box is on sale for $42. You can get both pieces on my site right now for $215 if you need it. So ultimately, that's what I meant about having the right tool for the right job. You have to know exactly what you're going to be using it for, and then you make your decision on which machine you want to get. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and get into this. The first thing that we want to do is we want to actually find out how much Everclear do we have. That's why I have this big measuring cup right here. Let's find out how much Everclear we have and then based upon that, that'll let me know how much of our herbs that we need to decarb. Let's do this real quick. All right guys, so we're coming in right at three and a half cups. We have, yeah, we have exactly three and a half cups of Everclear. So we know exactly what we're starting with, three and a half cups. So since we have three and a half cups of Everclear, I'm gonna use 40 grams of this sour diesel that I grew myself. Right here I have 180 grams of sour diesel. This is the buds, the trim, and everything. I'm gonna take 40 grams out of here. We're gonna put it in the decarb box and we're gonna use 40 grams in order to make this tincture. And also guys, you know how we do it whenever we're decarbing. It's always at 250 degrees Fahrenheit for 30 minutes. That is 121 degrees Celsius for 30 minutes, 250 degrees Fahrenheit, for 30 minutes. Now let me get these 40 grams. All right, so we have the 40 grams of sour diesel inside of our decarb box. I'm gonna put the lid on it, put it in the oven for 30 minutes and let it decarb. So now that we have our sour diesel inside of the oven decarbon, let's go ahead and get everything else ready. We're gonna move this magical butter decarb box out of the way 
let's go ahead and get this thing going. All right, so it's pretty simple. You take off the head. We're gonna put in our three and a half cups of Everclear. Very good. One of the questions that I begin lately is, do you put lecithin inside of your green dragon, your tincture? No, you do not. There's no need for that. All you need is the Everclear and your decarbed herbs, and that's it. So we have to wait the 30 minutes for this to finish activating. Remember, it's turning the THCA into THC. That's why it's activating. So we're gonna give it 30 minutes so that it can finish that. Whenever that's finished, we're gonna put the decarbed herbs inside of here, plug this up, hit a couple buttons, and that's it. So let's give it 30 minutes and I'll see you guys in just a second. And real quickly guys, I do wanna thank my Patreon patrons. I could not do all the content that I bring you. I could not do it without the help of my Patreon patrons. If you wanna join me, click the link that's in the description. It's gonna bring you over to the Patreon where you can join for as little as $5 a month. The main thing that you get is you get to see the videos early, but you do get other benefits and perks besides that. Oh snap. So as you can hear, we're finished decarbon. Let's get this out of the oven and get this tincture making. Here we go. Woo! And real quickly here, one of the big questions that I get every time I do this is, whenever it's decarbon, does it smell up your whole apartment? You can smell it. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. You know I never do. You can smell it, but it really doesn't get really bad until you open that up. Woo! That's that smell that I enjoy so much. All right, so we're decarb, great. Okay, so now that we have our herbs activated, the next thing that we gotta do is pretty simple. We're gonna take our herbs, we're gonna put it in here with our Everclear. Let's do that. There we go. All right, so we have our activated herbs inside of our magical butter machine with three and a half cups of Everclear. The next thing that we gotta do is we have to put the head on it and start the machine. Let's do it. All right, so we have the head on the machine now. We have our decar box out of the way. Let's go ahead and plug this in. Now on the instructions, it says to hit the 130 Fahrenheit button and the tincture button, which is the four hours. But if you recall, whenever we did the Levo video, we did that one at 160. So we're gonna hit the 160 button for the temperature because we want everything to be the same. We did 160 with the Levo. We had a 25% loss. We're gonna do 160 on here for four hours, just like we did with the Levo. And we're gonna see how much alcohol do we lose whenever we do it with the magical butter machine. So let's go ahead and do that. That's at uh, 160 and then four hours. And that's all you have to do. So we have four hours to waste. Whenever this is finished, we're going to strain this back into the measuring cup. And that's going to let us know how much Everclear did we lose in the process of doing this. I'll see you guys then. All right, guys. So as you can hear, the cycle is finished. The four hours is done. Let's go ahead and do this. I have my measuring cup right here that we had before. On top of here, I have a strainer and I have some cheesecloth. As I keep telling you guys, whenever I use my magical butter machine, I always use cheesecloth. I used to use coffee filters, but cheesecloth is way easier. I'll put the link in the description box for Amazon. But let's go ahead and take this off. I'm gonna unplug this. Let's take this off. All right, so let's do this. As we know, we put in three and a half cups. Let's see what we get out of it. You know what, I think I wanna double up on this cheesecloth. There we go. All right, here we go. All right, so I got everything out of the magical butter machine. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pick this up and we're gonna squeeze it and try to get everything that we can get out of it.
All right, guys, so I just got everything out of the Magical Butter Machine. As I'm looking at it right now, we ended up with three cups. We put in three and a half cups and we got out three cups. So that's a 14 and a half percent reduction. With the Levo machine, we got a 25% reduction. With this machine right here, with the Magical Butter Machine, we ended up with a 14 and a half percent reduction. So that's the answer to the question. How much alcohol do you lose whenever you make tincture in the Magical Butter Machine? Well, we just did it and we ended up with a 14 and a half percent reduction, which is not much at all. The final thing that we got to do now is we got to go ahead and bottle this up. I'm going to put it right back in the same bottle that it came in. Now the channel is over 50,000 subscribers now and I did promise you guys that we would do a Magical Butter giveaway whenever that happened. So over the next couple of days, look forward to seeing that. We're going to be doing a Magical Butter Machine giveaway. I'm going to give away a Magical Butter Machine and I'm also going to throw in a decard box as well. So look forward to that coming up in the next couple of days. Now, let's go ahead and bottle this man and finish this video. Here we go. So guys, that's it. I really appreciate all the love on the channel. Until I see you guys the next time. Peace and good eats. I'm out guys. Much love. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. If you want any of my merch, the aprons, the hats, the shirt, make sure you hit up the website shop.goodeats420.com. I'm out guys. Much love.